Take more water as if it's a small boy. Get up. Take some more water. This person is the king of this village. Do you realize that? A German. What has she done wrong again? Look at the way she's commanding you. As if you're, you're, you're a small boy. Take more water. Don't she realize that, that you're the king of this community? And you're even obeying her, obeying her command. I don't know why you are difficult. Very difficult to please. Your wife is here. Doing her job for you. And instead of being grateful to her for doing that, you are here trying to make her something for nothing. If not that you're my father and you're the king of this community, I mean, I'm started suspecting you. You've said it, Ojemba. You've said it. I think uh, uh, you should take out time. You take out time to reflect on your life. Because uh, your behavior sometimes, uh, sometimes make me wonder the type of father and king you be to your children and this kingdom. You will be a very strong king and a very strong father to my children. Mm -hmm. Yes, I don't want to be weak. You see, there's something with women. The moment you show, exhibit some symptoms of weakness, they use you as rag. Oh, you got it wrong again. Uh, you, you, you get it wrong. Uh, look, beautiful, humble, and uh, and uh, obedient wife God has given you on a platter of gold. Uh, Elisa can never do such things. Never ever in this life. Is that so? Mm. You are bloating now because Igwe is showering praises on you. You are bloating like a loaf of bread on fire. Go inside and find something to do. My lord. I'm not sure with his highness yet. What else is meaning? He will take the other drug in 15 minutes. Don't worry, I'm here now and I'm going to administer the drug to him. So go. Your highness, I shall be in my room. Is that an invitation? If I got a jam on my own, go to go to hell jam. Come, come, both of you. Have you washed my car? The one I'm going out with. Which of the cars, my prince? Which of the cars did you wash? None, my prince. And you're asking me which of the cars? But, my prince, you did not tell us you were going out this morning with any of the cars. Oh, well, I see. So I have to come every morning. If I want to go out, I'll come and beg you, sirs. Please, I am going out before you wash my car. Yes, you are sorry, my prince. You're moving, you're moving. I don't need drugs. How are you finished? You think you can just move like that? Come. Come, 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 come. I have an ask. Eh? Now, the two of you, for this, wash all the cars in this compound. Wash the ones that are spoiled, go back to the garage, wash every car there, whether they are moving or they are not moving. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, yes my goodness. Now go. Yes, my goodness. What is it? I love nothing. Nothing. You're almost scrubbing me as if I'm on the floor. And you're telling me it's nothing. My lord, you asked me to come to your room. So, if I ask you to come to my room, does it mean that if I ask you to come, can't I call you for us to just lie down? Are you so much on heat? All the time. You're so much on heat, I can see it. That you almost have your brace between your thighs. Instead of the normal place. Look, even if it has to happen, I am the one who should initiate it, not you. Please, Zubwa. My lord, I'm sorry. Sorry for what? for yourself. In fact, if I had wanted it, I would have asked you to, up, to remove your clothes from there.
we, we don't have to be neglecting this your sickness. So. I think we have to do something about it. Either I take you to a doctor or send you to a hospital. Yes, sir. I've spoken to your sister over the telephone. I told her I'll be coming to London next week for the treatment <coughs> and surgery. Okay, surgery too. Yes. <coughs> Sorry. You just have to stay, you know, take your time. And how, how long do you intend to stay? I won't take more than three months. But you know, your sister may not allow me to return after the three months. Igbo, why are you in a hurry to come back? To come back and do what your head is more important than to be coming back to. Just go there, even without sickness, you should go there and relax. Why should I relax when I have my people here to protect and attend to? <coughs> Igbo, this is your people, are they more important than your health? Igbo, let me tell you, if we look for you and we don't see you now, God forbid. Do you think these people will not exist? This community will, will continue to exist and those people will you know, continue with their normal work. Your health is more important. In fact, I'm going to tell Adesi to keep you there much longer, even after you are You are right, all right. And on the busy. Yes. On the Life is most important. Ojemba. Please, I want you to be calm and kind to your wife, Elisa, while I'm away. That woman needs your love and care. Sorry, I think I've heard. Always attend to my people. Except uh, in cases that are too complicated for you to handle. Do I've spoken to no one about that. Oh, no, Igu, Igu, uh, hey, that's another thing. If you are moving out, you know I am the crown prince. And by right, I'm supposed to be on your seat until you come back. Tell Olo who not to come there and struggle for power with, with, with me. Because I'm supposed to be the right person there. I know how you know who will come. You will not think it, it's, a, it's an opportunity. Let him stay there. Of course, I will attend to your people. I will. Which case are you calling complex case? How complex is, is it that I cannot you know, handle the case? Hey, but don't you trust your son again? I trust you. <laughs> I trust you, I do. <laughs> uh, you have to put your temper check. <laughs> I trust you. I can't see people say it is my temper that is the problem. But it's the people that look for my temper. I trust it, you myself. It does not it does not mean that. Crying. Is she shedding crocodile tears? As if she's not happy that Igwe is leaving. Ojemba, you, you should be consoling her. You believe me, I know this species they call women. In fact, the world should have been a better place if God had created only the main folk. Because the moment you go and get yourself attached to this, that is problem. Igwe, come, let's uh, go before we miss the end. <laughs> I still wonder if you will ever change, Ojemba. I don't have to change it. We like father, like son, even though I am tougher than you are. <laughs> Igwe. My children. You're crying too? I'm not going away forever. Hmm? I'm not going away forever. Um, I'll soon be back after my surgery. Thank, Thank you, Your Highness. What is this cosmetic romance with Igwe? I'm just helping him get into the car. Oh, yeah. Because Igwe is a paraplegic. Igwe is lame. You will come and enter the castle before we lose the, we lose the light. You missed the equipment. Really? really? Yeah. Come. Igwe is not a paraplegic. 
Am I helping him get into the car? Why are you helping him? Is he lame? It was easy. It was easy. Where are you going? To escort Igwe to the airport, my friend. As parents. what? As the ADC? Because Igwe is blind or because you are the ADCs? But Igwe inside the house and find something useful to do. Why are you all of the people playing like the preservants of catechism? All of you are playing good now. I well, love with Igwe. I don't think I'll still be here till the king comes back. I have to go. Mbaka? Mbaka, why? Why now? Sometimes you ask questions as if you don't understand the things that are happening in this palace. Then you ask as if you are not here with us. Mbaka, let's stay here. Let's stay back. Let's relax here and see what happens next. Did I hear you say stay? Uh -huh. did, did you say we should stay? Let me ask you. Let me just ask you once. Do you think that Prince Ojimba for once will change his lifestyle? Is that what you're thinking? Eh? I mean, a prince that treats his wife I mean, the future queen of this kingdom, the prince treats her like a slave. <laughs> Talk more of you and I who are just mere bodyguards. You did think about it. Maybe he doesn't love his wife. <laughs> yeah, you talk about his wife. But the question here is, are we his wife? I think everybody in this palace has failed to understand that Prince Ojimba is a sadist. He's a sadist. Nothing more. Nothing more. Mbaka, you know that. And I know. But I still beg, let's stay back. You know we have no option. Let's stay here. Please. Outgrown serving your husband breakfast. Okay, well, since you are no longer interested in what I eat and how I eat what, let me see. Call me the person who will do something. Chiwe! I said, go outside and call him. I don't even want to see you. Please. I know, I'm sorry now. I'm sorry too. Chiwe! Chiwe! You serve this. Yes, my prince. Good. Take a look at it. Come close and take a look at it. You will not concentrate to look at what you want to serve the crown prince of Umama. You want to kill me. Look at even the, even, 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 even the cup. 
sorry, my friends. You are very sorry. When you be sleeping for, for anything on trousers that can give you quick service, you will lose concentration. Look at you. Concentrate on most of all you maids that are here. I have seen your, 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 your sniffers. Your sniffers. You can't even allow me to buy a heel dog as a dog, a domestic dog here. Because I'm afraid of you people. Look at it, you eat and grow tiny. Make it be. Sorry, my friends. You are sorry for being like Mother Wire. And you're happy and bragging about it. Look at what you brought for me. Okay. I'm sorry too. Because we have to leave. <laughs> this floor has not been cleaned for weeks now. Now that you have reminded me, what have you people been doing? Look at look at that. I'm sorry, my friends. That you didn't clean it. Sorry for not washing the tumblers. Sorry for bringing me a dirty cup. Sorry for everything. What are you not sorry for? Boys. Males. Go and pack your property and leave me. Don't let me be physical. Get out. It's my business. You have started insulting me. Look at what you brought for the prince to kill him. Leave. Leave my side. Sorry, sir. Yes, ma'am. I used to stand in TV. My lord, mm -hmm. I want to have a word with you. My lord, I said I want to have a word with you. Must I raise up my head or close my newspaper before you say what you want to say? I listen with my ears, so if you don't have anything to say, go ahead. Well, Chiwe came to my room complaining to me that you asked her to leave the palace in 30 minutes. And uh, she went about a lawyer, which is you. You are now interrogating me and questioning me to find the evidence with which to use to prosecute me, isn't it? My lord, I am not prosecuting you. She just told me to come and tell you because I am your wife. And because you're my wife, are you supposed to question my authority? No, my lord. Good. So if you have been doing something, go back to what you have been doing now. Just like that. Yes, I'm here. My lord, it's past ten in the night. Very tired. You see, when it comes to the question of husband and wife, marriage, you know, time is of no essence. Mm. Yes, when it is husband and it is wife, and you know, through the time to the gallows. My lord, mm. what is it? What do you want me to do for you? Uh, uh, all right. I'll tell you what it is. But I'd like you to come to my room. Let me tell you what. You should come to our bedroom. <laughs> nah, you're laughing. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that's much. I was wondering why you're in my room by this time. But my wife and uh, each time I remember my wife, you know. So. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my lord, I'll be there. I'll be there in a bit. It will soon be soon enough. Mm -hmm. Let the time be short. Okay, my hmm? lord. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting for you. I want you to start coming now. Mm -hmm. yes. Start fast. Let's start fast. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll be there in less than two minutes. I'm counting time. Okay. I'll, I'll count time for you. Mm -hmm. Okay? okay? I'll be waiting. I'll be there in a bit. Two minutes.
you're through, you can see I'm exercising myself so that I can give you the hammer. Mm. <laughs> come on, pull off and lie down. <clears throat> come on, come on. I want to knock your engine dry. <laughs> come on, remove, remove, remove. They're doing fast. You know, we don't have all the time in the world. You know? Eh? Good. Would I help you remove them? No, I may be in the haste. I may tear them. Yes, with you, yeah. the prince will come, the double prince. Really? Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Mm. Remove this, are you? Are you shy? Oh, I'm not. I'm just... You want me to remove it for you? <laughs> come on, come on. My lord. I can do it. Mm. Stop there. Where are you taking her to? Don't you know again? Have you forgotten that we're walking under instructions? What the fuck is happening? Sweetheart, how are you? Um, um, what what is happening here? Would you go back to that gate, my friend? Can you imagine? And what are you still doing there? Would you get away from here, my friend? It's okay. <laughs> Please. How are Sorry, you? Sorry, Queen Elizabeth. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm so happy to see you. Hey, me too. You need to see how they stopped me as if they didn't know me again. Okay. <laughs> you don't have to blame them. They're acting on the somewhere instructions. Oh, instructions. I mean, what stupid instructions? Like this gloves. Let's go inside. I'm so happy to see you. Me too. Hi, Papa. Mama. Bye. Choco, choco. <laughs> I mean, I can't believe my own sister being served by mates and guards, and they even call you Madam. <laughs> IJ, forget all those ones. You see, wherever there is a crown, there are thorns that come with the crown. And only the strong and patient hearted like me can withstand the pains of the thorn to wear the crown. Yeah, yeah, everyone says that, you know, but. People could go extra mile just to wear the crown. IJ, you don't seem to understand where I'm coming from. You see, this seat I'm sitting on is very hot. And it's even hotter with the kind of man I'm married to. Hey, you keep talking in parables since I came here. Oh my god. IJ, Prince Ojemba might be the prince of Umoma and the heir apparent to the throne. But he's a disgrace and a pain to any woman that gets married to him. Wait, you're talking about your husband here? I mean, does he go after other women? Hi, Jay. I would so have loved it if my soul dear husband goes after other women. But no, he does not. He's just, he's just a, a, a beast in human's clothing. Hey, Lizzie. There's something you're not telling me. You, you know you can always talk to me, right? Oh, come on. This, oh, God. Talk to me, Lizzie. Spark. Mr. Jemba, good day. Mm -hmm. Why didn't you tell me you were coming to my house? Do you just barge into people like that? You just invade people's privacy without prayer notice? Huh? Please, this is not how to do things are hard these days. Before you do this, you tell me, let, respect people's privacy. By the way, who served this drink, Elizabeth? I did. I asked for the wine. You ordered for the expensive ones? Didn't you see GBO there? Couldn't you have gone to take the cheaper drink? It is just a red wine, my friends. No. It's not just a red wine. Because you are taking it and you are smiling. That should be having a very positive effect on you. That moves it out of ordinary. Not just red drink. We have ones we buy in pounds sterling. We have ones we buy in dollars and others in Naira. This is supposed to be on the high side. And you just went, boldly went and brought it out like that. Huh? Because it's easy. Mm. 
if you need drink, I'll take the cheaper ones. What was the meaning of that? This was just what I was telling you about crowns and tons. This man is just a beast, a dead beast. What are you talking about? What are you saying? Oh my god, Aidra, you don't understand me. This man is killing me. I don't... And you stay here. Hey, Lizzie, come on. To hell with the crown. What are you saying? Let this be the first and the last time. If your people want to come here, they should be invited. Or they should give us prior notice. You cannot discuss with them and then they just stroll into this very palace without informing me, without my authorization. Why would you do that? My Lord, I'm sorry. I didn't know Ijoma planned coming here. I would have told you. That is the more reason why you should have sent her back. Because she didn't call, she didn't give anybody any prior notice. What do they think this place is? Cape of Good Hope? This is not the kind of palace where people just stream in and stream off at will. I'm sorry, my lord. You won't repeat itself again. Please, it had better not happen. Where are you going? Have I finished? Did I tell you I'm finished? My lord, I'm going to my room. I want to sleep. When I have not finished, I'm going to your room. Have I asked you to go to your room? I'm sorry, my lord. Okay, go to your room. No worry. My lord, I said I'm sorry. Go to your room. Good night, my lord. time to talk to Jemba, but hell no, he never listens. You know I didn't really have more time to spend with the queen before her demise. I would have been certain if he got this attitude from the queen. But the king is just the direct opposite of Prince Ujemba. Just like him. And did you tell mama and papa about this? Hell no, I can't tell them. I mean, you're just going to keep quiet and suffer in silence. That beast is going to kill you one day if you don't know. Aichi, what do you expect me to do? But I just can't, you know, when I remember how we suffered as children, hawking plantains and bananas on the streets. I just have everything. If not for anything, for the fact that our parents are in laws to the royal family, that's all, nothing else. I don't know what to do myself. I just. Oh, that is really a I just stopped crying. You hurt me. I'm sorry you're going through this. I'm so sorry. Why are you here? I hope everything is okay. I'm fine, Mama. You said you're fine. I'm fine. Ever since you returned from the palace yesterday, you've not been your cheerful person. Tell me, is everything alright with your sister? Mama, Elizabeth is suffering. She's suffering. Eliza is suffering? What do you mean that Eliza is suffering? Talk to me now. What is the problem? Eh? Talk to your mother. Mama, you need to see how Prince Ojembama treats her as if she is a maid. You need to see his reaction over a bottle of red wine that she served me when I visited. 
She's suffering. Hey! How come Eliza never told anyone about this? She even warned me not to tell you people because she still wants people to respect us as in-laws to the royal family. What royal nonsense? What royal nonsense I'm asking you? She's passing through a royal pain all in the name of royal glory and she doesn't want anyone to know. For what? I am going right there to the palace to go and see how much is left of her. No, Eliza. No, Eliza. What is it this time? And who are you quarreling with? Ijambo was just telling me her experience at the palace for the past two days she was there. How Ojimba was maltreating my daughter as a commoner, as a common maid, not a wife. And then what are you planning to do? To the palace. I want to go to the palace, of course, to go and bring her back. Oh, oh, relax, woman. Ijambo here told you and you jumped into conclusion. Now you want to go to the palace to cause confusion all over the places. Hey. Hey. At times, at times I wonder the kind of man I married. Oh yes. 26 years down the drain, you never wondered. It is only now that you are nearing your grave that you are beginning to wonder. Still wonder. Keep wondering. But let me advise you. Allow the young woman to marry her husband. The husband that is maltreating her. Is that what you're saying? Is it, is the it, husband that is maltreating my daughter. Is it your business? Hey. Is it any of your business? If he's maltreating her, is it not for Eliza to talk? Is it the woman that will talk? Papa, <laughs> she confided in me because I am her sister. Oh, oh shut God. up! Won't you go to a place and look for any useless conductor to bring in here to marry you? Instead of sitting down here talking, talk, 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 hey! My daughter will not marry a conductor. Over my living body. She will not marry a conductor. She will marry in due time. Agbada, 23 years. She is not here to marry. And you are sitting down here. Your mother is confusing you. Your mother that has lived her life circle. Married a very sweet loving husband. Oh yes. Gave birth to you and Eliza. All she is now waiting for. Is just any mortuary that can allow her. That can admit her. So that she will go there and sleep. That is the kind of woman you are, you are, you are listening to. Do you know who you are? A foolish man. Oh, yes. Useless man. Oh, yes. You are the one that is going to die. Oh, yes. You will die. If I die, where will you get money? You will die and I will bury you. Where will you get money? I will, get money I will bury you. The suit that will die and I will bury you. I am an Ichia. Where will you get money for five cows? You can see. Ichia for mouth. Of course, I am an Ichia. Ichia no. Ichia no. Ichia no. Ichia no. Ichia for mouth. You will die and I will bury you. Very soon. You are the one that is going to die. Oh, and I will bury you. He's Papa, Papa, Papa. man. Stupid Papa, man. Very Always soon. causing confusion in the heart. Right. Always causing trouble. Look at look at you follow man like you. Maltreating your daughter. Very soon. Very soon. They will add his royal issue to my own name. <laughs> Try this in for you. So are you I know, my lord. My mother sent for me. My mother sent for you. Elizabeth. Just a few days ago, Ijoma, your junior sister, left this very place. Now your mother is summoning you. To come and see her. As if you're not under somebody. You are just floating in the palace. Is that what you think? My lord, this has nothing to do with Ijoma's visit. Are you still living with your mother? You are in this very house. And unfortunately, I'm sorry. Because I won't allow you to go. My lord, I want to go answer my mother's call. It's somehow now. I can't just reject her call like that. I say shut. You can't. Re go let your mother marry you. If you want your mother to marry you, let your mother go and marry you. 
I have said, if you are my wife and my law, law, you have to obey me. And that's what I've said. Leave. My Lord, are you saying I can't... Okay, go. Go and see your mother. And then carry all your property there. My Lord, this is not fair. This is not fair. This food. I corrected it myself. Is there any problem? Hi. This man. This man. Look at how you are eating and chewing like a goat, being skinned on fire, while your daughter is out there in, in the palace suffering. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Allow me to manage to swallow this malaria medicine that you concocted, all in the name of food. Please what? allow me to eat it in good faith. Bad mouth. Bad mouth. Ajanu. So, Ndukwe, you are calling the food that took me time to prepare. Malaria medicine. Hey! I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Why would you blame the man who made you work in life? Why would you blame him? <laughs> Just listen to yourself. <clears throat> Ndukwe, who made who? You! Just thank your God that I agreed to marry you and your wretchedness. If not, you would have died long time ago. Thank and you, your mother. Thank you, Mother Teresa. Mother Savior, thank you for agreeing to marry me. If not for one thing, if not for one thing, I would have given you a knock on this your coconut ah, head. Yes, point. I just want to look at my head. Not me. Then the ghost will appear in skirt and blouse. I swear, you will go mad before the marketplace. Hey, okay. All right. Now the bag goes. Now the bag. Now the bag. Now the bag. Uh-huh. 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 It has been two weeks since I sent for my daughter. And up till now, I've not heard the word from her. Are you sure everything is alright with her? You are asking me? You are asking me? Yes, of course. No, yes. I thought you are the wisest woman in the whole of Omo Amai. Yeah. You are now asking the bloody wretched fool you mercifully agreed to marry. Shut up, you man! Shut up, you man! Foolish man! I got these oranges for you from my house this morning. Oh, that's so nice of you. Thank you. How are your people? They are fine. I sent their greetings. Please, when next you're traveling, do let me know. Hmm? And send my regards to them. I will, Lola. Thank you. What is it, Zimbaka? The prince, Lola. That. Don't worry, just go back to your duty post. Thank you, my lady. My lord, what are you doing here? What were you discussing with him, Baka? <laughs> that. He just brought me oranges from his village. He just gave you oranges he brought from the village. A guard just gave you oranges he brought from the village. And you accept it? Yes, my lord. Playing love overtures with oranges. Are you that cheap? He said he went to his village and he brought me oranges. Just, just a formal thing. I didn't say anything wrong with that. Who told you it is formal? Did you search his conscience to know whether it's formal or it's just a normal thing? You're now an inspector of hearts. 
and you have inspected that they examined him and you are sure it is pure heart. Look, you have to mess up, mess up with an adult, not an idiot. My prince, please stop shouting at me. What is this? What kind of embarrassment is this? I insulted you. When somebody is bringing love overtures with oranges on my supposed wife, and you say, no, no, I want to hear you. No, no, come, 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 come. I want you to repeat it. You said I insulted you. Huh? I No, 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 no. Come on, ask me a question. Oh, I see. Oh, roll out a And you're not afraid. You're an idiot. I'm talking, and you're still looking at me. With my wife. So you have been dreaming of a royal waste to devour. And that's my wife. If you hit me again, if you slap me again, I'll hit you back. What did you say? Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? Wonder shall never end. No, we'll be in jail. Let me go copy this. Jesus Christ. You think because I've been joking with all of you? Don't worry. at once before the prince comes back. He's not going to do anything. I'm not going anywhere. Have you forgotten that he's the prince of this land? And the heir apparent to the throne? You have to leave at once. Just leave at once. Go. Okay, you're right. I'll go. I've had all you said. Let me go in and pack my things. You don't have to go there. I'll, I'll pack your things for you. I'll do it for you. I'll bring it to your house. Just go. Thank you. I'll go. You just take care of yourself. I'll do. It's just that I'll miss, I'll miss all of you. I'll miss everybody in the palace. I'll, I'll miss you too. I'll go to my house now. No. You have to leave your mom at once. Just leave. Go! But with that, I must warn you. Because you two have to leave. Nobody can tell what will happen in this palace next. I need to leave. I'll think about it. I'll take care of myself.
like my purse is back. Uh -uh. Why is there so much noise downstairs? Come, come, let's go and check. What's happening? Who's your love? Who's your love? Arrest is happening here. Uh -uh. My lord has not got into this now. This is a family issue, not a police what? case. What family? What family issue? Do you belong to this family? You belong to the family of your boyfriend. I don't think they provide that silly ass. Everybody is going to rotate. In fact, arrest that too. Arrest me? Madam, I'm so sorry, but I have to come with us. Come with you? Yes. What is my case? We will explain that when we get to the station, and I advise you to remain silent. Or anything you say here, we will use against you in the court of law. Let's go, please. What is this now, my lord? Officer, move, hey, move, move, don't, move, touch me, arrest, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch her. She's Queen Elizabeth. Untouchable. My place. Please don't let her take my little and my place. I did not even notice. Arrest her. I'm not going to talk again, my place. No, 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 Aha! Uh -huh. Arrest her too! In fact, all of them! Uh, let's go, let's go. Move, move. Get up! Move it! Move it! Please, move it! Please, move it! Please, move it! Move it! Please, move it! Please, move it! Move it! Us! You are pleading for us! You have not pleading for yourself! Look at how foolish you are! You are talking about us! Double arrest. Officer, please, I didn't do anything wrong. You deserve double arrest. You will tell me that you will go to the station. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, go. Come on, move. Move, 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 Stop! 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 That rubbish place called Palace and bring back my daughter here. Come Have you forgotten what we suffered in this village? Eh? You speak as if you don't even remember. By reason of poverty, nobody wants to associate with us. In fact, we don't have surname. Let me take it that way. People have been treating us as if we are leper. Yes, but I don't have lepros. Just because of poverty. Nobody wants to associate with us. But since my daughter, Eliza, married Prisogenda, yeah, things have changed. In fact, everybody wants to associate with us. By reason of that royal marriage, people are now respecting us. In fact, if I'm passing through the seat, people will be telling me, it's <laughs> and now we are calling chairs. <laughs> And uh, 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 you know, Iwe, Iwe recently gave me 10 plus of land. That's because of this royal marriage. Yes. And even he went ahead and made me the chief tax collector in every Eka market there. Now you are sitting down here asking me to throw all these things away just because of your nonsense and stupid idiosyncrasies. Ndukwe? Eh? Ndukwe? Eh? I have always known you to be a foolish man. But I never knew that your foolishness has ascended another dimension. Hey! Come back. You have always seen me as someone who speaks nonsense. But you don't know that most of them, <laughs> you get truth from that nonsense I speak. Hey, John. Hey, John. I heard that the prince arrested everybody in the palace, including Lizzie. Hey! Hey! Ndukwe! 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 I'm going to the police station. Hey! I'm going with you! Oh! Hey! 
I know that somebody is after me. I just know that somebody is after me. My girl has always been chasing me around. I know that. But I, I swear, I swear, Holy Ghost fire must catch him. Holy Ghost fire must catch him. In fact, Eliza is going back to that palace, whether they like it or not. Come for please wait for me. That you are coming right behind me. End the way. Hey, you, you're a useless man. I am always been a useless man to you. You want me to go to police station? If police is your friend, police is not my friend and can never be my friend. Look at what you're saying. Eh? Look at what you're saying, Ndukwe. Take a good look at your daughter's face. Eh? Look at what a fellow man like you did to your daughter and you're here saying nonsense. Useless man. Hold on. You should know that marriage is not a bed of roses. I have always been saying it. Oh no. You're saying all these things because you don't know what is happening. You've not seen the way that that beast maltreats my daughter. Reducing her to a male house help. Where are you there? Corporal Eliza. Where are you there? But sure no go. Ndukwe, you better keep your mouth shut if you don't know what to say. Oh no. I got the information from the right source. Yes. Eliza. Let Eliza go inside and rest. They will now think of what to do. Okay. Oh no. Please, I still want to thank you. I want to thank you immensely. If not for you, who knows? Eliza would have been in Krikri by now. Asya Chan! Asya That is why I am the Oh no. Hmm? He should reserve these greetings for His Highness. He was the one that called me from London and asked me to go and release your daughter from the police. How did he know? Through the phone. People called him maybe from the village or from the police station. I don't know. But it's through the phone. Oh, thank you very much, sir. It's my pleasure, my daughter. Hmm? Call me anytime you need me. Just call me, okay? Oh no, I still want to thank you. I want to thank you for rendering this help to us. Forget women. Every time. Eliza. Papa. Uh, where is he, Jama? She stopped by the pharmacy to buy me some drugs. Oh no, don't worry. We won't need you again. Because next time it will be her turn in the police. Use this man! Use this man! Where are you going? Come on, tell us for six! Use this man! Come out and face Priso Jemba! I don't have time for you. Because by the time I was fighting Saddam Hussein and his brother Chastello, you were not there! This man, this. Come, let's go inside. I will deal with this man. She only resists from her hand. He who God has blessed, he has blessed. In our own case, our own blessing is royalty. Hey! Ndukwe! You're a foolish man. Eliza, don't mind him. Oh. He is only telling you this because of what he will benefit from that palace. That's all. He may check one way for us. Easy. Any decision you want to take, make sure you're taking it not to please anybody, but for yourself, so that you won't take a decision and you will regret it later. Yes, your sister is right. Forget the crown. Forget the truth, everything about them. Forget it. Your life is more important than any other thing. That beast will kill you. Eh? Inanu? Well, I've heard what you all have said. I'm very grateful for your support these few days I've been here. Thank you for your contributions. I'll think about it and know what next to do. Better. Just follow your heart. If you take time to listen to your heart now, your heart is beating palace, palace, palace. Ndukwe. That's all. Ndukwe. Take your time, oh. You take your own time. I'm warning you, take your time, oh. I'm warning you. If you repeat this again, I will, I will, I will teach you, I will show you something. Oh, 
know I should have been told the time I was marrying you 26 years ago that I was trying to bring it and tighten it in my house. If you try it now, you will see that I'm a rich man with tiger. I will just devour you and eat me alive. Do you think I am like a useless brother in the United States? Papa. That couldn't even control her wife and her wife had to never... Don't come my brother! 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 What is it again? Mama, I miss Prince Ojemba. I don't want to lose him. And I can't wait to go back to the palace. My daughter, you see, crowns are good. Riches are also good. But when you have all these things without joy and happiness, which comes from the inside, I wonder where that will lead you to. You see, forget about all your father is telling you. Yes, he's a man. He doesn't know what it means to be a woman or what it feels to be treated like one. My daughter, I'm your mother and I love you very much. I've always wanted the best for you. So I want you to be sure and accountable to whatever decision you want to take now. I understand where you're driving at. But I love Prince Ojemba. Who? Oh. Though my body detests him, but Mama, my heart cries out for him. Oh. Temptation. Temptation. Eliza, are you sure you are not enchanted by Prince Ojemba? No, Mama, I'm not. Mama, I love the Prince so much that even the more he maltreats me, the more I fall in love with him. I'm not happy about this myself, Mama. But I must follow my heart. Hey! Oh, I'm finished. Eliza, why are you telling me all these things? Mama. Eh? Oh! Hey! Hey! Eliza! Mama, stop Eliza, crying. Eliza! Mama, hey. stop crying now. Stop crying. It's so okay. You are telling me all this Mama, thing. stop crying. What do you want me to do if you're crying now? <laughs> I'm finished Mama, stop now! Crying. Eliza! Mama, it's okay. Mama, be strong for me now. Eliza! Yeah. Elizabeth! Papa, I'm here. Oh. I'm ready. Papa, where are you taking the boat to? To the palace, of course. Where is you think I'm taking it to? Or don't you know that you don't visit the kings and the prince empty handed? So after all the prince did to my sister, you still want to shake his hand with a goat and a whiskey? Oh, shut up your idiosyncrasious mouth! What do you know about tradition? What do you understand about the traditions of our people? Or don't you know that you use what you have to get what you want? Useless man! Useless woman! Useless man! Useless woman! So you want to use your daughter for money making? Oh, of course. Look at it. Look at what you're taking along with you. Of course. As good as dead. You must cut your coat according to your height. So I see. That's why I'm going with this. And besides, she is my daughter. Whom I produce from my... Mm, 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 mm. Of course. Hey. So what is wrong if I'm using her to make money in a very coded way? Mama, Papa, why are you quarreling now? Eh? Mama, you have to understand Papa. You know he's just pulling your legs. Eh? Mama, just be strong for me. I just want to go back to the palace. You push stop quarreling. Hey! Papa, let's go. I don't know for you, but since you decided to go back to that palace, just make sure you take good care of yourself. Eliza, let's go. Don't mind this thing. Mm. Take care of Mama for me. Papa, let's go. Use that man. Enemies of Papa, let's man. Use less man. Use less man. You are using your daughter for money making. Of course. It's your way. God will pay you back. God will pay you. Dukas, Dukas. My prince. <laughs> I remember your trees on the field that time. Whenever Dukas is at the center forward, 
In fact, the goalkeeper of the other decision will be <laughs> at lost. Do you still play football? Ah, uh, you know, you should know now. Once a soldier is always a soldier. Always a soldier. Yeah. <laughs> I forget the, the greatest, you know, you were a little bit smallish that time, but terrific. You were a terror. I let somebody told me once, I think they said you traveled overseas or something. Uh, really, really, it's true. I, I traveled outside to further my education. To play football? Uh, no, 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 not at all. I did my, my first degree and now rounded it up with my master's. You have your master's now? Yeah. Wow, that's a big one, no? <laughs> Hey, so what establishment are you working with now? Oh, uh, my friends, for now, I'm jobless. How can you be in such a with your bogus certificate? That's Nigeria for you. This country, this country is something else. How can somebody come, you know, after doing all these things, you still come back to, you know. Anyway, in your own case, you do not have, uh, you should have continued with football. Uh, no. No. But look how you work. A trail in football. You never know. You know when somebody has something inside, you don't even know. It people. Will... I was thinking that by now we should have been even one coach of the English uh, <laughs> football club. Honestly, that is nature. Yes, searching for you. Well, uh, if not for your intimidating certificates, I I would have you know looked for a job for you. My prince, uh, which of the oil company are you talking about? <laughs> is it Ajib? National, Tezako, NNPC, and <laughs> have you finished the oil company? National. Well, no, this very one is URF. Yes. URF. Yes. What's the meaning of URF? Homo <laughs> Maroya family is here. Yes, uh, no, I, I, it's, a, it's a, a job, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's a job I could even... But to be honest with you, there's no job in this country. There are people who have been moving around with book of certificates like that for 10 years to be masters, no job. I say a guard? No, no, it's not a guard. It's not a guard. It's something like um, an assistant, you know, personal assistant sort of. It's not a degrading job. Do you realize that I'm a graduate? And I did my schooling at abroad. That's why I'm saying that your certificate is intimidating. That's why I'm saying it's PA, personal assistant, so that I mean almost on the same level. But to tell you, Madoka, there is no job, but there's no point pretending about it. Because you could roam the street for the next one year, you don't have any job. So it's better if you take my advice, you take the ones that you have, and manage until you have something better. Hmm? Well, my prince, I don't have anything to say for now. I should go home and think over it. When next we'll see. Fine, fine. No, okay, okay by me. Okay by me. Let's just pray. Drink, 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 drink. So, how? Which of these is, is, is it in states? Uh, yeah, it's okay. In Oxford. Huh? Oxford. Yeah, that's wonderful. My prince, I am kneeling before you, not because you are the prince of Umar, but because you are marrying my daughter. We had the unfortunate incident, what happened and how she ended up in police station. But that's not why we are here. I came with this white man drink and a, a goat which is tied outside. Pleading on her behalf so that you will accept her back to your house as your wife. Please, my prince. Please. Look, you are busy talking. The person you're talking about is so nonchalant about it. I am her father. Please, I'm pleading on her behalf. You know, you paid the bright price to me. Please, accept her back. Talk to your daughter. Come on. Later, I'm pleading with your husband. I said, Later, I'm pleading with your husband. My lord, I'm 
sorry for everything that happened. I promise it won't repeat itself again. Forgive me. By the way, where is this my PA or what does he call himself? Manuka! Ma Manuka! 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 Look at him. Did you hear him? He has employed a PA. What? Who knows what will happen tomorrow if he will employ a confidential secretary? A female confidential secretary. Eh? And by the time you know it, she will turn into a, 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 a confidential romance. And Papa. by the time that happens, happens, you are finished. Papa, what is even wrong with you? Will you shut up? Why were you kneeling in front of him? He shut up! What kind of embarrassment is that? You, you, you beg him. You beg him. Papa, I'm not kneeling down again. No, 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 no. no. Ah. It, it, is, it is royalty or nothing. Papa. Shh! Do I have to do something? Yep. Whenever I'm here, be around. When I have visitors, I look for you, I will not see you. Uh, my friends, I'm so sorry. You know why I didn't call you or refer to you as my Inba? Because that's your daughter. I'm not sure she will stay here. <laughs> Thank you very much, my prince. She will stay. She will stay. <laughs> Thank you, my prince. You say she will stay. She hasn't said she will stay. Talk to him. Tell him that you will stay. I Lord. I will stay. <laughs> my prince, you will stay. <laughs> she will stay. Thank you, my prince. Look, I want to tell you that, you see, your daughter thinks she's beautiful. <laughs> she's beautiful. And I want to remind you that your beauty it's just like a flashy label on a rotten product. <laughs> My prince, she's so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. She's so beautiful. Come, Madoka. My prince. Take this. Yeah, you brought it for this. We're going to keep it on a very shelf. Go and keep it. Handle it with care. It's a white man's drink. Keep it the, below the down shelf. Don't keep it where this thing because it's an impurity. It will uh, this thing. And then later you go and uh, untie it. You say you brought a goat. <laughs> a very big goat. He's tied outside there. Go and check the goats. You people and the house boys can use it for pepper soup. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, my prince. It's all right. I've heard you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, my husband. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you, my prince. <laughs> Thank you, my Lord. Rest. What does that your mood has to got, got to do with, with, with what you are what, what I am demanding? What what will tire you out? What will change your mood? But why do you find it very difficult to understand it? I said I'm not feeling fine. I cannot give in to your urges this night. Listen, not feeling fine for what? Tell me. What have you done? It's it's when you stress, when you strain yourself, that is when sickness comes. This, since morning, you have been indoors. And that's what happens every day. Because I know you do not stress yourself. And you're giving me this reason. You're failing in your duty as a woman. My lord, I cannot give in to your urges this night. I don't feel fine. I will not kill myself. Oh. I cannot. Oh, it's my urges now. Mm. You are not, it's, you're not perturbed. It's my urges. Listen. I want you to take note of your failing your duty as a wife and as a woman. It is written, even in scripture, you should not fail your husband when the demand comes. When a man is on heat and you do this kind of thing, you're putting the man, throwing the man to the gallows. My lord, I cannot do anything this time, though. Please, oh. I need to rest. 
Haba, would like you my son? Rest from what? What have you worked? I am strained. I am tired. I want to rest. I do all the work in this house. My lord, I have to rest. I don't feel no, well. No, 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 check. I want you to listen, note it down. That you have failed this night. And when I fail in my own duty because I'm tired, don't complain. No problem, my lord. It's alright. Good night. Okay, fine. Okay, no problems. Just keep checking it. Don't worry, you're tired. Now not good night. Good, it's all right, no problems. I will get tired. Push me out of this bed. It's all right, I am tired. I need balance. I don't want to do now, my lord. Let me sleep now. Then allow me balance. Hmm. Hmm. My lord, you're pushing me out of this bed. Uh, look, I'm tired. I'm, I'm not well. I'll leave this room for you. I'm not well. My you are failing my duty. My Lord, I don't like this thing, no. Allow me to sleep now. Is it what? my fault? Get a balance. Okay. I'm looking for balance. Is this girl? Does she not hear me? To this girl to follow me. Where, where is she? Let me give her 10 more minutes. She's not here to follow me. lady do you just wave anybody you see on the road whether you know the person or do not know the person sir i wasn't know you to actually lift yes i think for security reasons you're supposed to know the person you're waving down oh, wait a minute are you close with your mom it's like uh, well yes i'm prince with Jemba. wow i can't believe that i'm seeing you in person well, here I am. Uh, well, since it's like uh, you're familiar with me and my name, I'm around there here now, and I decided to come home uh, and establish something around here you know, to help my people. And I get to be close to the institution. You know, if you know that I'm Prince of Jemba, you know that I'm going to take over the reins of power after my father. So I have to be close to home. So that's why I'm home. So, is there your village? No, no, no. My village is uh, it's, uh, two villages away from here. Yeah. Are you from this place? No, no. I came for a cousin's wedding. Okay, here. Yeah. So you're from? I'm from Omumba village. Oh, the next village? Ah, it's along my way. So, well, since we are now getting familiar, why don't you go in? Let me give you a lift. Thank you very much. Elizabeth! Elizabeth! Eliza! My lord! Come, come, come. Why is this place so kept? You didn't sweep this place today. My lord, I was cleaning the house and making your favorite meal. I don't feel well at all. You know I'm just one person. And I can't do all this on my own. Uh, the whole uh, compound will have to remain like this until you're better off. Is that what you're trying to let me understand? My lord, maybe we'll have to employ more guards and maids. I can't do all this alone. I need help. More guards and maids? On whose account? On our account, of course. Our account, you see. You're getting paranoid. Our account, as if you are involved in making the money. On our account. That's what you just said. You're spitting. When I'm talking, which means all I'm saying is badadash to you. Huh? My lord, please, eh? I don't feel too well at all. Let me just go inside and finish up what I was doing. Then I'll come back and clear this compound for you. Right now, I don't have strength to argue. Please. I've been talking nonsense. Come. Okay, fine. You decide to go in. Go in. My lord, why are we arguing this morning now? Let me just go and finish up your food. I'll come back and clean this compound. 
Eh? No problems. Go and finish it. When I come back, when you finish the food, you are going. Believe you me. Well, my prince. Um, well, how are you sure that uh, this other woman you want to marry will give you all the qualities you need in a woman? I'm the person who made that decision. I don't want you to begin to argue it. I have decided. I relayed this message to my father, the evil, and he did not make any argument, which means he sanctions it. So I don't want you to be making all these argument, argument, argument as well. I mean, you're not my lawyer. Uh, but my prince, I'm not your father. You made me your PA. So you PA now because principal advisor? I have the authority because that's what I've been doing as your PA. I can call you your PA petit advisor. I'm your personal advisor, which you know. And it's what I've been doing for the past months, if not more than a year now. What is making you, what is charging you up? My prince, you are the cause of everything. How? You don't adhere to the advices that I've been giving to you. Maduka, you are holy. I don't know whether it is the tie or these your hangers that have been making you talk to me like that. You're talking to the crown prince. Is that the way you see it? What qualifies you to be the it's what, it's what I have upstairs, and you know. That's all right, Maduka. Signed, sealed, and delivered. I have said, I have decided, I am going to take another wife. You are not married. You don't know anything in the Department of Women. I haven't even seen you chase any woman, not even the mates. That I am not married does not mean that I don't know anything that concerns marriage. You read your own in books. I practice it, so shut up. Go and get me water. What is the other half of that, Yonika? It used to be trouser before. Just look at you. I told you. I told you not to go back to him. But you insisted. Look at what he has done to you. I'm so sorry for disobeying you. I'm very, very sorry. But what could I have done? I flew my heart. What do I do now, Mama? How come you never knew you were pregnant all this while? Mom, I suspected it too. I suspected it. I just wanted to be sure before I told the prince. Now look at what I've gotten myself into. So what are we going to do now? I'm the most confused person on earth, Mama. I don't even know what to do. I don't know where to start from. Hey. Hey. Oh. She, she did tell me. Oh? She did what am I going to do? Eh? My daughter. Mama. This is your house. Nobody is going to throw you out from this place. You will stay in this place until you have your baby. Whose name is this child going to be? My father's name or my husband's name? Whose name? What will people say, stop, Mama? Stop, stop, Eliza. You don't have to worry about all this. Hmm? All I want you to do is just concentrate. Concentrate and pray to God to grant you a safe delivery. That should be your utmost concern, not whose name the child will bear. Certain things that you do that irritate me. In fact, since you came, that I should not have condoned, but I decided to condone them. Why? Because you're still new, and uh, I'm still looking at you to see whether I give you a chance to adapt. You're not supposed to be challenging me in public. You have thrown back words at me in, in, in presence of the palace guards that I don't like, plus one or two other things which I will let you know later. But I must point out those negative behaviors. They don't go down well with me. That was why I called you to tell you 
to give you options. Listen, I am the heir apparent to this throne and this community. And therefore, I deserve some respect from whoever is going to be my law law. You must play your part and play your part very well. You must play the supportive part very, very well. Not just take anything, just do anything, anyhow. If we look for my father today and we do not see my father, I am the person that's going to be crowned king of this community. And if you must be my law, you must key in. You must give me support. Not challenge me. Not talk rudely to me. Because I am the king of this community. So you have to possess some qualities of a queen. If you don't have those qualities, then you can still make up your mind and then go. Ojimba. There you go again. Ojimba. I'm sorry, my lord. But my lord, I thought marriage are meant to be celebrated. But the way you are going about this whole thing, it makes me feel as if I'm a slave that also comes to satisfy your sexual urge. This is not just a normal marriage. That is what has not sunk into your head. This is royal marriage. This is royal ceremony. Look, Abu, this is royal relationship. Like you said, marriage is not just marriage. You have duties. And I don't want us to come here and bandy words. No, I won't come to bandy words with you. Because I am the king to be. So, take some time, think about it, ponder over it. If you can cope with it, fine. If you can't cope with it, go back to your mother's house. I don't want any argument again. Now that it is still early, or whether you're going to find your way. Because next time, we will not be talking soberly like this. Afadi. Come, 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 come. What did you just say? I'm sorry. I had to. That's better. Stop now. Stop this thing. Stop. Stop! What is this? My Lord, please make me feel like a woman. Touch me. Touch you. Stop this, stop this. Ah. I can't even remember inviting you here. Did I invite you? When you came, I just left you. You should have lied down quietly. Did I invite you? Stop! What is all this? What is even wrong with you? You know what I think? I think you need a doctor. What? Yes. I should see a doctor. You heard me. You're talking to me. I should see a doctor. Because I don't want to be killed. With your instant demand for sex? And you say the prince needs a doctor. I don't believe you said it. Hmm. Eh? I want to know, I want to ascertain whether you said I need a doctor. You need a doctor to siphon whatever you have on your waist. Is that what you mean? That's exactly what I mean. That's exactly what you mean. Come. Come. Why don't you leave this back? Why, Maruka? Maruka? Prince. God, God is okay. Hey, okay? Go and get the car. Thank God that I have sacked my, 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 all, all, all the cars. My Lord. My Lord, please, now. Look at you. I thank my God that these guards are no longer here. My Lord, please. You would have made all of them bow legged. All of them would have been laid. In fact, they would have had tired manhood by now. A single woman. What is wrong in a woman desiring her husband? I don't have that kind of huge appetite for sex. <laughs> Sorry! I resigned my job just because of you. Don't worry, I'll compensate you. Don't worry. Please come! My lord! Leave me back! What do you see? Now you are going to go. You go with okay? Drop her wherever she's at. Make sure that she's dropped wherever she wants to go. Go, take this in. Go, 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 go. 
Time has come for you to possess what really belongs to you. <laughs> possess that which really belongs to me. I don't understand. Just guess. My prince. There you are. You see? Your heart and your soul still belong to the prince. But you don't want to listen to the voice of reason. That's where you are. Papa, I only mentioned his name simply because that's the only topic you bring up in this house. And besides, he's a married man now. <laughs> that's where you are. You see, I was just coming from the room now. I saw his BA. And you told me that he was just coming back from the park where he went to drop off that silly girl. Called a, 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 a prince wife. <laughs> you know, prince has sacked her. <laughs> so this is it's your turn now. <laughs> sack, 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 sack all the time. What did she do? Why did he sack her? What is? Will she do? What did you do? You? Papa, that means he will still send me packing if I go back to that palace again. Eliza, he will do no such thing. <laughs> Beside, now. <laughs> I'm going to protect you. In fact, I will cover you with my magical configuration yeah. called African insurance. You see, it is a kind of a concussion that binds lovers together. <laughs> and yeah. you will enjoy your life. <laughs> Papa, I am not interested though. I will never ever enchant my prince. Mbano, I can't do it. You see, Eliza, you don't understand something. You are pregnant. And nobody is interested in a pregnant woman. That's more the reason you must accept the prince back. You see, you must plan to get this man either by hook or crook. Papa, so you're not deceiving me, right? Papa, I will go back to that palace only on one condition. That the prince comes here crawling and begging to me. So I can follow him back. If not, Papa, me, I am not going anywhere. Settled. I can't hurt my baby. I don't want anything to happen to this child. Settled. If that's what you want, if that's what will make my precious daughter happy, <laughs> oh my goodness, I will personally go to the palace. Make the prince to come here prowling and begging you. <laughs> that, that is settled. But don't go there. Don't go there. If you go there now, you start feeling cool. As if, as if we're begging him to come and pick, pick me up from here. Before Uncle? Of course. We'll beg him. Who is interested in a pregnant woman? Don't you know you're an after one? Nobody is interested in an after one. You see, there are many virgins around. Young boys are interested in those virgins. And not to talk of somebody that has passed through the funnel. Well, it's an advice I'm giving you. If you want to take it, if you don't want, if you want to be useful to yourself, take my advice. Your mother is deceiving you. Papa, this is not fair. You should be advising me as your daughter and not as a stranger. Hmm. God, if my father can say such a thing about me, who knows what outsiders would say? God. I commit this into your hands. Please, Father, take control over this situation. Don't let my enemies laugh at me. My fellow girls will be laughing at me now. Hi! What do I do? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No, 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 there's no... Don't you trust me? I mean, you should trust me, Father. I mean, I'm, I'm grown up now. No, no, everything is okay. Sir? Oh, she's very close to me here. She's, she's uh, sitting by me here. Oh, of course, Nana. Don't you, don't, you, don't, you, don't you trust me? Don't you know what I can do? I mean, I'm just like you. You can't make wrong choices. <laughs> 
That is, she is, she is, I don't know how to describe her. She's a prize. She's, she, she, she's, she's a prize. Prize, prize, prize. Very expensive prize. Daddy, I can't make that assessment for you. I want you to come back and then make the assessment yourself. And then tell me. <laughs> Igwe. All right, sir. Father, how is your, how are you recuperating? Okay. Okay. Please tell my sister that I love her so much for taking care of you. Yes, sir. All right, sir. All right, All right sir. I'll be waiting. I will even call you again before then, sir. Thank you, Father. Wow. It's just so obvious that, that you are in a good relationship with His Highness. That's an understatement. My father happens to be my idol. I adore him. Just like my dad. Really? He's also my idol. Really? Yeah. That makes the two of us. It's lovely. <laughs> I just heard a knock at the gate. No, the PA is there now to open the gate. Who is that? Am I supposed to go to the gate and open the gate? Don't you know that I'm a So when is he coming back? Mm, I don't, my sister decided. My prince, this man wants to see you. Hey, my prince, I greet you. What can I do for you? You see, we have waited for you. And you are not forthcoming. So I decided to come myself. Waited for me for what? <laughs> my prince, is she a confidential secretary? What? I beg your pardon? It's all right. He asked me a question. Allow me, let me ask him. No. She's not my confidential secretary. As a matter of fact, she's my confidential wife. Ha! Wife? Yes, wife. My please, uh, don't you think you are pushing forward so much? Because I don't want anything to happen to the future prince. That's the Umbam baby. What nonsense! My lord, who is this man? Who is this thing standing here right. before me? It's all right, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Just keep your cool, don't worry, it's my visitor. Thank you very much for your concern. Now, is there any other thing you want to say? Oh, oh well, I'm, I'm true with all I want to say, but... Uh, hey, what of the Umbam baby? Our future prince. Why do you keep referring to somebody I don't know as on my unborn child? Listen, go and ask your daughter who impregnated her. Ask her with the father of the child she's carrying. And please, you know the way you came in here. I want you to go out through the same route. Never ever come back to this palace again unless you want to sleep in the cell. Do you understand me? So you mean we are free to do to the baby and the mother anything we want? You can sell them into slavery for all I care. Okay. I've heard you. Madam, thank you. Get out. My lord, I still can't believe what this man just said. What did he say? I still can't believe you have a child from another woman. And you couldn't even tell me. Do you know I'm your wife? And I have the right to know everything that goes in and out of your life. Are you done? Is that the answer to my question? That is the answer for now. Don't worry, let's drink up and then go inside. No. No, no. You must answer my question. I you. Did I say I wasn't going to answer your question? I said let us go inside. Your you know I can't deny answering your question. Okay? My precious. I can't. Don't worry, let's drink it. Don't bribe me. Don't bribe me. I you must bribe answer me. my question. Don't I bribe will me. I answer your question. Pass it. Answer. Where is this girl? Does she not hear me? 
to this girl to follow me. Where, where is she? Let me give her 10 more minutes. She's not here to follow me. Don't tell me you're, you're, you're here sleeping, Ch Chica. Huh? Am I not permitted to sleep in my room? Well, I invited you over to my own room. Not until you answer my question. Which is? Not until you tell me what I need to know about my husband. How about now? Listen, Chica, I'm not ready to stay here and exchange words with you. I'm going to be counting time. If I wait for you more than one minute in that very room, you will see. I'm counting time for you. Imagine or dream me to come to his room. Anyway, let me not talk. I know what to do. Come, Chica. Are you telling me that you ignored my orders, my instructions? I won't move an inch from here. I won't move an inch until you answer my question. I won't move an inch. Until I answer your question. Yes. Until you answer my question. Hey, Chica, you are my wife. You are going to answer my question. Listen, I'm your husband. What are you saying? Everything is a joke. You raped me. And I'm your wife. You raped me. What would I? You raped your wife it's and you beat think. me up. Go on, enter the car. Open that door. My prince. Yes. How do you beat her like this? Even to the extent of raping her. Why would I beat her? Why would I rape her? Why she refuse to give me what I legitimately paid for? What is she here to do? By the way. If not to make me happy and to give me the worth of my money. But my prince, rape is a serious issue, even between husband and wife. Who are you? Her lawyer? No, 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 not at all, my prince. Then shut up and allow me to do what I want to do. I think I have to take her to the hospital. See, she's, she's, she's behaving as if she's going to die the next minute. Let's go to the hospital. Uh, stay around in case anybody comes to for me. Now, listen. I don't want to hear any pain, any whimpering from you again. In fact, if I hear any pain from you again, I'll go inside and rest until you're ready to go. Be able to see if you're going to die any minute. Enter the car! Very good. As a car owner, I'm now your driver. You have to sit at the back, the car owner. Come on, come on, go front. my prince yeah um i hope you have enough food yes my prince this is my wife okay. yeah give her whatever she wants to eat hmm? yeah. she's not feeling fine she's not feeling fine. i have an important engagement but i'll be back all right. before she finishes i'll be back oh okay all right my dear yeah. let me go before you finish i'll be here okay what do you have uh, i have rice and salad yeah. and salad banga soup chicken oh. Got meat and then uh, rice. You said you have um, msala, right? Okay, let me have msala with um, semo and fresh fish. And give me fried rice and chicken as takeaway. Uh, uh, sorry, excuse me, do you have any good juice here? Yeah, yes, we have so many of them. Okay, let me have chilled five for life. Oh. Thank you. You know what? Choma. You know where I caught her? Mr. Biggs. 
with that chief we met the other day. Tell me no, something. No, she pretends a lot. I know that girl is a chameleon. Yes, I know that. I was telling you, but you didn't believe me. Thank God you saw it with your eye. David, I was surprised. I was surprised. Oh, I, you are still I surprised. You say, is it true, okay. ma? Okay. Bless you, ma. Let this is true. I'm gonna take all this place. I'm sorry, ma. I was clearing some dishes. I hope uh, you are through. Yeah. Okay. So where is where is uh, this, madam? Oh, my friends. Yes. yes, I'm back. Can I have the bill for what she eats? Yeah. Let me get it. I will be okay. Hey, it is my face. No, I think there's a mistake here. You gave me a list of what you bought in the market. I'm asking of the bill of what my wife ate. Yes, of course. That's her bill. This is her bill? Yes. Are you saying she ate all this one? Yes, my prince. The juice? The rice and salad? Yes, my prince. And then the the, the soup was uh, around there? Yes. And this is the final beer? Yes, my prince. Um, could you confirm this? Are these all the things you yeah, consume? Yeah, I ate that and I took it away. And this is the final beer? Yes, I think so. So you actually took all of them? Yes. I think you actually have to pay the bills. What? Madam? My lord? Collect your bills. My lord? My lord, what do you expect me to get you on the Come Oh no, my money. Give me my money. What? G give you which money? He brought my me here, you saw him. Why did you allow him to go? What you you want to actually vomit money for you, isn't it? You want me to vomit money for you? Why did you allow him to go? You know you are dragging me for all money. All I need is my money. Which money? Did, you, did I come here with any bag? Did you see me with any, any bag? My elders, it is true. I'm on this seat representing my father as the Igwe. But it is not comprehensive, it's not total. Because any financial commitment that is involved here it cannot be handled for me. By me. Vigo did not leave any money when he was leaving for running uh, this council or doing one or two other things. All the money I've been spending have been coming from my pocket. My prince, that is why you are his son and his representative. And uh, each year is right, my prince. Well, of course, each year is right. But where is the money? That's where he's wrong. My son, you should call the highness. And tell him what is on board. Maybe he can assist us from overseas. Where is that man? Where is that good for nothing man? My elders. Thank God you people are here. My elders, please. I want you all to help me out the prince here. The reason why he humiliated me before the people. My daughter, calm down, sit down. Sit down, my daughter. Calm down, sit down. What is it, man? My elders, we went to the hospital this morning because I was very sick. As a result of what the prince here did to me last night. And when we go to the hospital, the doctor insisted that I must eat something before taking injection. And my husband took me to a restaurant and asked me to eat. I ate. I ate all. After eating, I demanded for takeaway. Have you heard it? My prince, Allah, my daughter, continue. When he got back, <clears throat> I asked for the bill. And the, the bill was given to him. My elders, do you know what the prince did? The prince refused to pay the bill and left me there. I was abandoned. He left me there all alone, knowing I had no money with me. My prince, that is bad of you. You shouldn't have behaved like that to her. I get so disappointed when elders begin to talk like kids. Just because she's a woman and she's crying, she came in here all of you turned emotional. And you are questioning why I did what I did. You are not even trying to go to the depth of it to know why I did what. No matter your reason for the action, you should have paid the bill. When you come back home, you saw it out with her. She's your wife. She was just editing it, going to the periphery. 
If somebody I took to a, to a restaurant to eat, just enough food to sustain the, the, the powers of injection that was going to be given to her. She went there and started to freelance food consumption. She ate, she took in some food. The mother for take away and take her about and take her up and take down. That wasn't what I took her there for. My daughter, how much was the bill? Just come on, 2,515 naira. Huh? 2,515 naira. It's come on. It's too much. Uh, you are blaming me. No, no, no. no, no uh, not for the wife of uh, a prince. You know, only that our prince seems to be very conservative in spending his money. But not uh, 2,000 naira. He could have paid the bill. I think the money we were looking for, I think we can go to Ichi and then call, collect that money. Because the way you are talking, you are, you are talking with muscles in your mouth. Which means you still have something at the end of your cupboard. How did you pay the bill? I got Samaritan. Came and paid the bill for me when the woman refused to let go of me. And that man was the extra kind. Oh, that's no marriage. After all, we are all married. Yes. You know, women of nowadays, they don't ask questions. They don't look well before they jump into marriage. Once you are a celebrity, a reality, or very rich with big, big, big cars, they throw cushion into the wind. Uh, uh, the next thing, they will leap headlong into God knows what. And now you are suffering. That's why you are crying. You have made a mistake. Bank should be paying your consumption bill, honestly. If you continue to eat like this, you will explode. <laughs> it's okay, my brother. It seems that if you eat like this, it doesn't come out from your body. It's okay, my brother. Yeah? Oh, the weather is okay. <laughs> It's okay, okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. my daughter. <laughs> it's okay. My friend. Now you know. It's all right, man. This was somebody I took to go and eat food. Not only did she eat everything that is on the tray there, she went gaga with eating, drinking. She ate, every, in fact, she drank every liquid like a tanker. She it took fruit juice, he took apple juice, pineapple juice, all the fruits and all their juices. What was the entry? And they expect me to come and, and pay this in. I will have a separate bank account for her consumption. Which I never even see anyway. She's your wife, console her. Console her? So that tomorrow she will eat more. Are you going to pay the bills? What's more console? Please cry so that some of the food can go away. Did you see her? No, my prince, I didn't see her. Did you search very well? I searched everywhere. Even I moved the building across the road. I couldn't get her. Well, that means she had gone. That's good readers to bad rubbish. <laughs> Thank God she had gone. I've been trying to see a way of sending her. She had gone on her own. So I'm free. No, my prince, I don't think that she has gone. Because what? as at the time I saw her, I saw her left with a, a small bag. So with a small handbag. Yes, my It doesn't mean that. There she is. Come here, Chick. Where are you coming from? I went to Salon to make my hair. At this time of the night? Oh, the queue was much, so I had to wait for my turn. You had to wait for your turn? Of course. So why couldn't you have come home and then postpone it to tomorrow? <laughs> my lord, the hairstylist is traveling first thing tomorrow morning. By the way, Chick, this hair is the hair that I've been seeing you carry. Not tonight again. This is a new hair. Look, look at this hair. Look at it. Check it and balance it now. Look at it. Check this hair. Feel it. Just feel it. Are it. you drunk? Check it. You don't even know anything about hair. And you're really concluding that it's not a new hair. You left whatever. Who knows? Huh? Why wouldn't you have told me before? Do you think you can just float out of this compound anytime you like? My lord, you weren't around. So I had to go. Then you should have waited for me to come. My lord? Yes. You expect me to wait for you to come to this house before I will go to Salon to make my hair? Of course, that's what you should have been. That's crap! I mean, what sort of marriage is this? You know what? I am sick and tired of you, this house, the marriage thing, and everything about you. Excuse me. Come back here, come back here, Chica. I'm not coming. What? Go and get her. Go and get her! My prince, since you are going inside the house, is it not better you enter alongside with her and discuss issues. Listen, I'm the man of this house and I'm the crown prince. 
go and get her. Even if I had to go inside that red house, she has to come back here and obey me. I said, go and get her. You're moping at me like it will be. Go inside the car. So, Chica, you think this is a big joke? After all you did, you couldn't even come to apologize. And you just came here and lied down. Chick, I know you, you are hearing what I'm saying. You think I am not worthy of an apology for coming late for all this nonsense you have been talking? Chick, I'm talking to you. Chick, I'm talking to you. You think, you think, you think I'm an idiot? Chick! Hmm? You think I'm an idiot, Chick? I miss this time. Next time, if I miss the whole body, I will not miss your leg. I will cripple you in this time. I told you that. Huh. So even it's even you. Yes, it's me. You are an idiot. I say it. I say it again. You are an idiot. For you to think that you are the only prince we have in this world. Huh? Even in England, we have Prince Charles, Prince William, and Prince Harry. Here in Nigeria, we, we have princes here and prince idiot. Why is your own prince? Always enter into your head. You see, it's either you're talking under the influence of alcohol or you're mad. Because I remember the last time you were at the palace, you were not talking like this. You were begging. You were almost crying. And look at the front. You have the front to talk to me like this. Why wouldn't I talk to you? Why wouldn't I talk to you? Because I'm a prince. You are an idiot. I say it again, you are an idiot. If you want it today, you sack tomorrow. You think it is the best thing for you. Hey, Prince, all those Prince, Prince, Prince. Look, the only reason why I have not pounced on you now is because of your age. If not that you are an elderly man, I would have dealt with you physically myself. Oh, yes. That's even more the advantage I have over you. If you dare me, no, I swear, if you dare me, I will, I will eat you alive here. Yeah? I will bury, in fact, I will construct a grave here yeah? and bury you alive. You are an idiot! I will not give you the privilege of letting you soil my hands. Hmm? I won't do it myself. Maruka, my prince, deal with him. My prince, you mean that I should deal with yeah. him? Yeah, deal with him. With Mazindukwe. Uh, Mazindukwe, be very careful. If my, if my prince touches you, you are gone. Is that the dealing? I said deal with him physically. Mazindukwe, I'm warning you for the second time. If my priest, if, if he lays his hands on you, you are finished. My, my prince, please, leave me. It's better we continue to where we are going. I, I will not be happy for you selling your hand on this man. Please, it's better we we'll continue to where we are going, please. I'm just begging, please, my prince. Where are you going? Ojempa, I'm leaving your house. I want to leave your house with my life before you kill me. No, 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 don't, 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 don't move like that. So why would you plan leaving before I come back? 
which means it's shady. Ojemba, Ojemba, get out of my way. Get out of my way now before I do something stupid. <laughs> I advise you don't. You have enough problems as it is. You want to compound it? Since I cannot vouch for your honesty, because you're not from this village, you're not uh, somebody from this community, I think I'd like to search that bag. Ojemba, you want to search my bag? Oh, yes. Akuya? Yes. Ojemba, carry bag and search. Search! Thank you. Search! Hmm? Search bag. Yes, I will. But I'm sure of one thing. Mm -hmm. God will definitely pay you back. After he will pay you back in your own point. Akuya, he will pay you back. After I search, keep on searching. Just search your search. Yeah? Search. Your Highness, the problem is if it will work. Uh, we will be praying, my dear. Especially now the Peter boy has traveled out of the country. I think she will listen to us. So when is the prince coming? Um, the personal assistant said that he will be here next week. Uh, not for the traditional right, but to see us and get to meet the uh, uh, there's a formally, yeah. Okay. So, what do we do? We will tell her. Yes, we will tell her. Ah. Your Highness, tell her. <laughs> you know your daughter very well. What if she revolts? Where, where is she now? She's inside. God, come here. Go in and call her there for me. All right, Your Highness. God, bring one chair. Yes, Your Highness. Honestly, you're welcome, my brother. What of your father and you? No, he go traveled uh, to overseas, you know, for his uh, surgery. Surgery? Yeah, he developed a kind of uh, thing, and the thing requires a uh, surgery, so he has to go there. Mm. But it's not something I. I hope he survives. His no, 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 no. It's not something that serious. Mm. So. But Bella, what brings you to this area? Hey. I'm surprised to see you around here. My brother, I came down to see a friend. Okay, friend. Mm. In uh, Umoma here. No, the princess of Umoma. The only daughter of Hugo Hugo. Umoma. You're going far. So what brings you close to a princess in the, of, of Umoma? I met her in a wedding. In Lagos, yeah. At okay, the first wedding. Lagos. Yeah, at the first wedding. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. okay. You trace her here. My brother, I have to leave whatever I'm doing to, for, to go, come down and see that girl. <laughs> the girl must be something else. <laughs> She's something else. Ah. Ah. Need to see. So, what's your, your intentions now? I'm to marry her. Beautiful. I can accompany you. I've already gone there. But the happy father said I'm not, I'm, not, I'm just a commoner. Why would you return to her? What of you? We have family. You understand? No, but that shouldn't count now. He says only a prince can marry a princess, and princess marry a prince. Commoners like us can afford a princess. Well, I, I, if they say, well, okay, let me not just go along that line so that I don't hurt you. Because if they insist, I will say, okay, fine, let me go. Since they need okay. a prince. How can you hurt me when they really rejected me? Well, I can't do anything about it again. I have lost out. But tell me, how, how is, she, is she worth it? If you see this girl I'm talking about, if you see this girl, you will melt like salt. She's beautiful both in and outside. You're know, saying this thing is becoming so tempting to me. You need to go. You're a prince now. They welcome you. Okay, fine. Because I'm I'm having my eyes there. So, wait first. Uh, Maduka! Maduka, get me brandy! Lucas! Yes, yes my prince. Uh -huh. Are you the one looking for the king? Yes, my queen. Why do you want to see him? Is there any problem? There is no problem, my queen. Actually, I, I lost my job as a security person. And ever since then, I have remained jobless. So that's why I came to see if His Highness can give me a place in the palace as, as a guard. Are you from this town? Yes, my queen. What is your name? Back on your book, my friend. In that case, come back tomorrow. 
By then, I would have spoken to the king about it. Thank you, my queen. I think we must go to that room. I insist on taking that girl, that princess. Something tells me she is it. Um, my prince. How are you sure that uh, the lady in question is not going to be worse than the other? No, 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 no. Ben, give me all the assurances that that girl is class, and I believe you. Uh, but my my prince, uh, you need to take time before you can now enter into another marriage, so that people around will not be insinuating that the problem comes from you. I don't understand you properly. How how do you mean? Uh, what I'm saying is, uh, you've been to three different villages and you've married three wives from the three different villages. Now you want to marry from Umoduma. That's the fourth wife. Um, people will be wondering if you are a tourist that tours to different villages and comes back with a wife as a remark that you've been to those villages. Though, my prince, your name is Ojemba. You should not allow that name to influence your life or your future. Are you insulting me? I'm not insulting you. How can I insult my prince? But I'm only giving you the advice as your PA. Madoka. My prince. Come, please. Come, please. Tell me. You know what I'm checking? You have not told me. The position of your brain is in the wrong position. If not, you will not be thinking like this. Your brain is very close to E. You should be at the normal position. If not, you wouldn't be talking to me or advising me. This is not an advice. You are insulting me. Next time, you want to talk to me and you don't talk to me with respect. I will pan a bit your head, shrink it to the normal size and put the brain in the normal position. My lord, I want us to talk. How about you, my friend? Not with the guards around. Guard, leave immediately. Yes, your yes, yes. highness. Your highness, it's about our daughter, Adese. I've told you time without number two. Remove your mind in her. She will change with time. When will she change? I have been waiting all these years for her to change. But it seems as if I'm going to wait endlessly. We go there. We go there. You started again. You started again. Because any time I want to deal with that girl or to take a case up, you are, you still do the wrong to defend her and plead for her. Now, what, what are you talking about? Uh, eh? My lord, in as much as she's behaving badly, but she remains our daughter. We're not going to kill her. Now, what are you suggesting? What do you want us to do? <sighs> mm, I've been thinking lately. Now that all these sitters are coming around her, let us encourage her to pick up one of them and marry. More especially now that that good-for-nothing boyfriend of ours is out of the country. You see, your suggestion is good. Yes. As a mother, you want your daughter to get married. Good. But I want you to know this. I will never allow my daughter to get married to a commoner. No, it is not possible. Hmm. Never. Your Highness, with the way our daughter behaves, what if such a person does not come to ask for a hand in marriage? Is she going to remain here forever? When that time comes, we will know what to do. Yes. Your Highness, I don't agree with you. We have to encourage her. Let's encourage her to, to make up her mind and, and pick up a suitor. Mother, I'm, I'm really tired. I'm fed up with her problems. My greatness is at stake. I am still the king of Umoduma Kingdom. Let us encourage her to get married. Let her get married and leave this place. She's not getting any younger. She will get married, but not to a commoner. No. No. Sexy, sexy boy. Wanna party? Aye. Sexy, sexy boy, you make me wanna party or not, you make me Ah, high to the sky, you make me ooh, 
Ah, wanna be your queen. Yeah. Have I told you guys that Amaka, my cousin's sister, is wedding next month? Are you serious? Wow. She Amaka. Uh, uh, Amaka, you know now. Hmm, that's good news. Hmm. You need to see how she parades herself like a peacock, thereby threatening all her fellow babes as if they won't get married someday. That's one thing I hate about girlfriend. Once their profile changes, they will dump you and treat you like a ripper. Don't judge by what Nega just said. Because Nick and Amaka haven't been going on well since I met them. I don't have any grudge. Just that I hate proud people. Anyway, Chikso, I beg, I want to ask one thing. Does this man have money? I mean, a gig, you know, does he have cash? Choma, <laughs> money monga. What do you do money with trust? Like your head and carry money. Try that. Money is power. Choma, I beg, take it easy. Yes, come in. The door is open. And easy. His highness demands your presence now. Tell him I'm coming. He said you should call me now. Get out from here. Who are you to command me? Get out before I was you slap. Make the king wait small. Now they're in here small, so you better not. They will be princess now. Alright. Just. Oh. See you soon, huh? Okay, we're waiting. I beg, I'll be begging you. What's your apple? I beg, now they beg you. I think I'll beg you. I'll be begging you. I beg, 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 I'll be yeah, yeah, I'll probably. Shake your backside. Shake your backside. Right, let's just come here. Father, you sent for me. Must I send for you to what is before you answer my call? Sorry, Father. I was trying to dress decent enough to appear before my king got married. Sit down. So you were naked in your room? No, Father. I wasn't naked. So why didn't you come as you were? I don't want you to cut me off before your present, Father. Okay. Anyway, I just want to let you know Next week, the Prince of Umoma will be visiting this palace. And I would like you to know that. That's good news, Father. <laughs> but you didn't ask why he's coming. <laughs> why should I? He's a prince and royalty. Maybe he wants to get to know you. No, my daughter. He is coming to get to know you these days. <laughs> For what, Father? <laughs> I don't know him and I don't ever remember having any business with him. Must somebody know you before he will ask for your hand in marriage? <laughs> Why does I stop putting my legs? I don't understand. Well, let me officially announce to you that the Prince of Umoma Kingdom, Prince Ujemba, is coming specifically for you. I can't marry a total stranger. Now listen and listen very good. You don't need to know him before you marry him. You don't. I did not know your mother until the day I got married to her. And look at us, living happily, rocking the boat of this kingdom with joy and greatness. So you don't need to know him. Father, that was then, not now. Uh, Adeze, you are royalty. Priso Jemba of Fumoma Kingdom is royalty. You need to marry royalty so as not to break the chain of royalty that has run in this family for over 10 decades now. No, I won't marry him. I, I will not. 
I can't. Now listen to me. I want you to prepare your mind, your body, and your soul for next week's visit. I have spoken, and so shall it be. Thank you, Father. Highness, I told you. I told her she was going to revolt, didn't I? She can't. Is there something I need to know? Look in your eyes for sure. But tell me something like say we're wrong things that you need to do. Oh, I can see you that you're in the mood. If you last time I have a truth, do it wrong this body. All right? Talk to us. My father wants to dash me out in the name of marriage. That's good news. Who's the mama, by the way? To the prince of Umwam or whatever they call me. Eh? Ada, on your kid, you want to When it's the no, no. That's the kind of news I love hearing. What are you waiting for, babe? Come on! Morning, morning. Chioma. You've not even met the man. Yet you're here jumping up and down just because he's a prince. One day you'll crucify yourself for money. No ma, it's you I'll crucify. In fact, I'll do money ritual and use your head to buy home a three. God forbid, it's your entire generation that you use for money rituals. Judas. Give up a Judas. And um, please, that is it. Tell me the real gist and leave these poor girls that don't want to be rich. Chama, eh? what do you want me to tell you? I don't even know this man. I can't marry him more. I dodge him. I'm not no, going to marry you. You know go dodge him more. You know go dodge him. In fact, I'll make sure you marry that prince. You must marry him more. The future prince of Umama. Babes, check it out now. Chuma. Now what for you? You are not for you. Adeze, I think you should give this whole thing a thought. Not just because he's a prince and what have you, but because your parents will never push you into fire. They would always want the best for you, you know. Babes, let's just leave her to sleep and think over what she really wants. I don't need to sleep or think over anything to know what I want. Definitely not that prince of home or whatever they call him. You know, sometimes in life, we don't get everything we want. But we try as much as possible to make the available desirable if the desirable is not within our reach. Mm. Mm. Okay, we got the point here. I mean, think about it. Here comes the bride, all dressed in royalty. Go. As for me, let for charming. That prince is a short ticket for a better tomorrow. Yes, sir. <laughs> this babe is going inside. Are you sad? Are you sad? Oh, God. Are you laughing? What is this? Don't tell me that you've been here all day smoking and drinking yourself silly. Eh? Mother, do I misbehave? Since I'm normal after taking the wire is alarm. Adese, this is totally wrong. This is unacceptable. You're a woman. You're a woman that is getting married soon. And not just to any other man, but to the priest of whom my kingdom. Mommy, don't tell me that you are here to preach about uh, praise or uh, chamber, whatever. No, I cannot preach to you because the case is already settled. I'm only worried that you might go there and start displaying this, this, this despicable habit of yours. Mommy, you are a woman. You should understand me much more better even when father fails to understand. My daughter, this is wrong. You're a woman. You're not getting younger. Rather, you're getting older by the day. You have to marry soon, my dear, so that you can bear children. I want to carry my grandchildren, my daughter. Mommy, I love Peter. And you know it. I, I love him. Can you tell me you love a man that traveled abroad for over two years? Eh? A man that traveled to hustle. 
how are you even sure that Peter is not there giving his life with, with another woman? You're here telling me that that, that you love Peter and waiting for Peter. This is this is wrong. I, I, I don't like this. I, I, I can't marry that man, though. I can't marry that man. I love Peter so much, and you, and you know it. You're really a pain in my neck. Mommy, why do they do this thing now? Eh? Why? I just disturbed my life because of one useless man. I beg. Oh. How many times will I tell you to always be handy? I'm sorry, Adeze. It wasn't intentional. I was only in the restaurant. Do you know that I'm not happy? Is there anything the matter? Does it mean you have not heard that my father wants to marry me out? No, not at all. I have no idea. I just did. Ah, thank God. At last. It's a very good news. Did you say good news? Yes, it's a good news. You don't even know who the person is and you're here shouting, that's a good news. And is it? I think His Highness and my Queen We never approve of anyone with a questionable character for you. That is why I said it's a good news. <laughs> I can see that you all are suffering from this sickness. But Adesi... Hey! What's wrong with you? Have I told you that I, I, I don't have to get ready before you? Huh? Must I wait for you every time? My prince, uh, uh, I was ready for a very long time. I, I had a running stomach and I now went back inside the palace to, uh, to ease myself. You have a running stomach? Yes, my prince. Why is your stomach running? Who is pursuing your stomach? My prince, it's, uh, it's uh, the food you cooked. Oh, the food? Yes, my prince. So why is my food not running? Why is it standing? Did you eat any food different from the one I ate? You see all these flimsy reasons that you give. It, it, it eats me at times. Do you understand me? When I say, get ready, get ready before me. Sorry. Come, let us go to Moduma. My, my Prince, are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. I think I need to be prepared. <laughs> <laughs> Foolish old man. I think yeah, you are not having running to running to work. <laughs> ah, you, see, you see, they need to, to have a woman in the house. Princess, Adesa, your mom said you should dress up, and you're still here. You're coming to chair up. Today is your introduction. Mm. Maybe I should give you the shoe to wear <laughs> Not now, babes. Choma, mm. I can't marry that man. I don't want to marry him. But if I pull, if I would and say hello, I have to go like this. What? God forgive about this. Why not? 
you can't go like ah deform my hand where well, yeah. see, see my hand okay. in the in the there is again you can go for my hand like that you're a princess and you want to go and see a whole prince like this no way you can't mm -hmm. do it Ada it's your day now it's your introduction you need to look good and decent so you make your parents proud mm -hmm. so in other words I should pretend now of course Ada we know you're the princess. But today, you just have to go out there and do what is suspected of you. Are we not the moving babes again? Of course, <coughs> now. Five for one. We are suddenly behind you, girl. Okay, just come on. Ada, my princess, do this thing for your babe. Now, Nachoma, you want me to start? Nachoma, do not for me. Do not for me. Just dress up. Fine, fine, fine. Okay, find something for me. That's what you know, yeah? I'll wake up now. Okay. Do your job for once and stop gossiping. Hmm? By the way, where is Mbaka? He went to his place yesterday night. Mm -hmm. And was he permitted? Yes. He told the queen that his mother was very ill. So she permitted him to go, but he will still be back in the evening time. Ah. Ah. Anyway, thank you. So it has gotten to the extent that this girl cannot stay there with us in the back. That's eh? what we call love and love. your job. And why that? Oh, Malacha. The princess, you look. You look good. Oh, you have to look very good. Ganga. Omali Cham. Adoma. Adeze. The princess herself. You look great. You look beautiful. Thank you, Mom. But, but, but you know I'm not happy doing this. Uh uh. Must you go through this again? And you don't worry. You will not regret it, okay? Hmm? You're going to be happy. And now I want you to I want you to wear this capla. Hmm? Okay. And bring your finger and this finger rosary. I want when the prince sees you, he will look at you as a good girl that was brought up in a good Christian way. Is that not true, girls? Yes, yes my, my queen. queen. Mother, I can't believe you are doing all this just because of this so-called prince. I am not doing it for the prince. I am doing it for you. Because your father wants you to marry the prince. Anyhow. Jesus Christ. I can't believe you are saying this. My dear, you have to do it for me, please. Hmm? Come on, Hmm? And if your friends truly want the best for you, they will tell you that there is nothing absolutely wrong in wearing a scapula and a finger rosary so as to make yourself more appealing to the prince. Is that not true, girls? Yes, yes my, my queen. queen. Ada, my queen is right. You have to learn it. Okay. Adeze, if this scapula is going to make the prince like you, why not? Let's go ahead and wear it. I told you. Hmm? Don't worry. You're going to be fine, eh? <laughs> Please, people should be fast, eh? Yes, sir. Everybody's waiting. Mother, what about the maids? And the maids, they are on standby. We're all waiting for you. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Don't keep the priest waiting for long, please. You guys should be fast about it, eh? Yes, yes my sir. I don't, ma'am. Hey, guess what is this? Scapula. Oh, yeah, a uh, good girl. She mm -hmm. never goes to bed, no smoke. The money, you know, say that man they pay. And they are not for dollars. What's your push? Prince, Prince. Handsome Prince. Maluka, my Prince. Is this real? You've seen it now, and you are still asking me if it is real. <laughs> and this? Ojemba. Um, Do you care for some? This, this one? Or this? Or this one? Or this one? Enjoy with the babes now. Is this a dream? Mm. 
Why you looking like you've seen a ghost? <laughs> uh, it's true. I do. Ajamba. No. 